Welcome everyone, I would like to show you how to update to iOS 15 on your iPad Pro. So you can see I've already done this, I now have the option to add widgets to my home screen, I now have the app library on my iPad Pro, these are features exclusive to the iOS 15 update. So in order to update, you just want to head over to settings, and then you want to tap into general, software update, and then inside of here you should see the iOS 15 release. And you can see here in the case of the iPads, it's iPadOS, so you can see here, iPadOS 15.4. This is the latest version of iPadOS 15, which is available. So once you see this option, you just tap on, download and install. It will take a couple of hours. You do not need to stay inside of this software update page. Once the download has started, it will continue in the background, meaning you can go back to the home screen. You can even close out of settings and the download will run again in the background. Once it's done, you tap on install and you're good to go. Here's the thing, what if this doesn't show up? Well, first of all, make sure your iPad Pro is supported. Now, any iPad Pro will support the iOS 15 update uh, from the iPad Pro first generation to the latest iPad Pro. I currently have the latest iPad Pro at the time of recording, and that means I'm good to go. If you don't have, for whatever reason, iOS 15, and you also have an iPad Pro, you just want to check a couple of things. First of all, tap into Wi-Fi, then tap on the I to your Wi-Fi network, Scroll down and you see you can configure proxy, tap into this one and make sure no proxy is on your iPad. Next, go to general and then go to VPN and then make sure that you do not have any VPNs uh, connected. If you have any VPNs connected, turn them off. If they don't turn off, tap on the I and then turn off connect on demand and then the VPN will turn off. If you're still having issues, I recommend you try another Wi-Fi network, or if you have a cellular model of the iPad Pro, turn off the Wi-Fi and then use cellular instead. If this still isn't working, that means you most likely uh, had an iPad Pro, which was either jailbroken in the past or was jailbroken uh, by the previous owner, and that's why you're not seeing software updates. So what you will need to do in that case is you will need to unjailbreak your iPad Pro. So what you need to do is go into settings, general, and you see about, you just want to check your software version. And so what we need to do is you need to go onto YouTube and then search up how to unjailbreak and then your software version. Now, here's the thing. You don't want to do the exact version. Like you can see, I'm on 15.1 right now. Just choose, you know, what the major release is. So 15.1 is an update to the regular iPadOS 15. So in my case, I would search up how to unjailbreak iPadOS 15. Let's say you're running software version 14.5.1. You will search up how to unjailbreak and then iOS and then 14 and then you will have a tutorial relevant for you. Same with let's say iOS 13.5. You will search up how to unjailbreak iOS 13 and then you will have a relevant guide for you as well. You can try searching up your you know specific software version. Just keep in mind guys that may not be a tutorial relevant for you and once you have unjailbroken you can go back to the software update page and the latest iPadOS 15 should show up. You should be able to download it without fail. So hopefully this video did help you out if it did. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're brand new. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.